this again. Tell okay, about it. so this motor is meant to be in a in a skateboard. It's kind of um, uh, a thing, I guess, that um, skate. Uh, you can make your own electric skateboard. Great, and, and awful one of those. It's a popular thing. So a lot of these parts are meant are come from the RC community. So I'm not an RC guy myself, so I had to. There's a lot of learning involved. Right. Uh, but the motor is capable of like 3,000 watts or something insane. It's like a 15 amp motor. That's sweet. But the I don't know if that's continuous or peak or whatever because the wires are 12 gauge wires. Okay. And what I know of 12 gauge wires is you can put 16 amps through them continuously. Okay. You do have a mosquito on you. Yep. Yeah. It's buzzing around. Your yep. Face. Okay. So, um, so this is a a throttle right here, a test throttle that you'd have with an RC plane or something like that. Nice. I, have it, I have it set okay. to a number and I, I did a hack an electronics hack into it that all you got to do is push this button and it'll it'll spin up it'll throttle up nicely and this is the battery pack this is the battery pack here um, the weight of it is a little tiny bit heavier than the gas version okay but I'll, I'm gonna flick it, it on now more awkward than the gas version having the weight down there you can try it if you want okay if you, but I know you're recording a video now right so I'm yep. gonna flip it on and wait for three blinks here. So that's the motor controller. Uh, again, it's, it says it can do 50 amps on it, but know. it's ready to go. Actually, this, that's not right. I wonder why I did that. It should you spin You made that all by yourself? Yeah, Just you don't want to stay away from that end. Yes, stay away from the other end. Did you make that? Did you make that? Yes, I made it. Yep. No. It's supposed to ramp up a bit more. I don't know why it's not doing it. Okay. But uh, it might have something to do with the settings I changed. The, there's a USB port I cut out recently there. That's hilarious. Uh, USB port on its weed whacker. Yeah. Uh, and But it'll still cut. It'll still work even though the throttle's not working right. Right. Um, let's just take a look at what the data says on here. I don't know if that's going to show up on the camera or not. So... Seven amps peak. Okay, that's not too bad. When I'm cutting, it said uh, the highest amps I've got is like 10 amps yeah. uh, peak. And it's running at 42 volts. Right now it's above 41 volts is normal, but it's fully charged right now, so it's at 43 volts. Okay. Um, so 43 volts is fully charged. Yeah. And um, yeah, I don't know why it's not ramping up properly. You know what? Let's, 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 uh, let's cheat a little bit here. So I'm going to just the, I have to keep the throttle here. Okay. That's what I want to show. That's the fun part to show off. <laughs> is, that, is that musical tone? Yeah, that's. Sure, don't hear that in a in a, left, in a gas one. That's how it's supposed to run. I don't know what was going on before. Hmm. It's not supposed to go instantly full on like that. It's a little dangerous. It was shy for the camera. Yeah, I guess so. Are you done recording? You still recording?